Hi, this is Matt from tracyandmatt.co.uk and I'm really excited to show you the brand new HTC Titan 2, uh, aka HTC Kaiser, aka HTC P4550. This is the final retail version of the device with its full retail packaging. As you can see, the device in tilt mode on the front and your standard um, black and green packaging inside. We have right seal and it's secured with a magnetic flap. And inside, the device is presented quite nicely in the middle with the foam packaging around it. Very similar to that of the HTC Touch. And there's the device itself. As always, we'll come and look at that in just a moment and we'll take a look at what is in the box first. We also have a pair of Headphones with the extended mini USB connector or enhanced mini USB connector. Uh, these look like slightly different design to the headphones that are shipping with the other HTC products, um, and they do look a little bit, a little bit better than standard. Also have a standard USB to mini USB sync charge cable. There is a screen protector inside, um, a note there to, uh, on how to join the HTC eClub. There's a what's in the box guide, we don't need that because we have what's in the box and I'll tell you what should be in here. Um, there's another manual here for license for Windows Mobile 6, there's also your HTC care pack, TomTom Tom guide. And warranty card, you'll note there, I said TomTom, TomTom comes with the device pre-installed. There's the manual, it's quite a substantial manual. And finally, right underneath, two CDs, here's your getting started disc, and also your application disc with Sprite Backup, GPRS Monitor and TomTom Navigator 6. This also has Active Sync 4.5. On the other side we have a case, and this is a really quality looking case actually. It's Velcro flap, and inside we have the battery and spare stylus, which is one side. Uh, it is a flap style case with a belt, uh, belt clip there, but it's um, quite a different design to the norm, and it looks rather good. Finally, we have a mini USB style mains adapter charger. The battery is 1350 mAh, and as I say, that comes, comes with a spare stylus. The device itself looks a little bit more polished than the uh, demo units that we've seen in the past, feels a bit more quality. It looks just slightly better finished than the previous one. Take the cover off the back. I know we've uh, looked at the device before, but very quickly, there's a 3 megapixel autofocus camera, built in GPS, 400 megahertz CPU, 256 meg of ROM, 128 meg RAM. It's a 320, or sorry, 240 320 display, 2.5 inch. It's got GPRS, Edge, UMTS, HSDPA, HSUPA. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 2, USB 2, the list really goes on. Uh, there's also a small front-facing camera for video conferencing. Mini SD card slot just in the bottom here, which is on the, like, the front portion of the device with a little cover over it. USB connector on the bottom, reset button, stylus, button for the camera, a button for the power on off. There's a scroll wheel which also acts as a push button there's an OK and a voice notes button on the front standard buttons on the front of that and the mechanism that we've all become familiar with over the past few months when we've been looking at this device is the sliding mechanism along with the tilt this again feels just that much better than the demo units that we've seen in the past um, feels good quality a little note on the back here to say 
This is where our SIM card goes, just in the front, underneath the main screen. And that's the device. Just a quick size comparison with uh, a device that I have on me here is the Samsung i600. Uh, comparable sort of footprint there on the front, so the Samsung's a little thinner. Um, not really any great deal of difference in the weight there. Possibly uh, a little heavier than Samsung. And as a comparison with the M700, you can see it is slightly larger, top to bottom, same left to right, but it is about the same thickness there, um, which is quite quite cool when you consider it has got the keyboard. Uh, we'll be reviewing this and checking it out. I'm sure people have got many questions, so if you want to ask us anything about the device, please feel free to do so. It looks like we are one of the first, in, if not the first, certainly in the UK, to have the full retail package version. And we're pleased to bring you this video. We'll have a review online soon.